Tom Hanks and his wife Rita Wilson have been making headlines lately, but sadly because they've been trying to recover from the virus that's sweeping the nation. Although normally the couple calls Los Angeles home like most A-listers, they're currently in Australia. They were staying there for the filming of the new Elvis movie which Tom is starring in. Tom tends to keep information about where he lives on the down low, but in this video we'll take a look at some of his mansions and much more. Thomas Jeffrey Hanks is an actor and filmmaker best known for his comedic and dramatic roles. He's one of the most recognized and well-known film stars worldwide and often regarded as an American icon. He's been starring in movies since the 80s with plenty of memorable roles like Forrest Gump for which he won an Oscar. Tom is 63 at the time of this recording and continues to impress with his ability to take on any character just like he did in the recent Mr. Rogers biopic. I'm sure we can all agree that we're excited to see the Elvis movie he's going to be in, even though production is at a halt for now. Like I said, Tom and his wife Rita have been living in a rental house for a while now in Australia due to filming of the movie. They've just been released from the hospital they were at in Queensland, but remain in self-isolation for now. I'm not quite sure where the couple is currently calling home, but we do know over the years Tom has owned some pretty impressive properties and maintained some additional vacation spots as well. Tom's films have grossed more than $4.9 in North America and almost 10 billion worldwide, which makes him the fifth highest grossing actor in North America today. That being said, his current net worth is estimated at a well-deserved $400 million. Hey guys, it's Karen. Today we're doing another house tour here on Famous Entertainment. Today we're going to be looking at the homes of Tom Hanks and his wife, actress Rita Wilson. I don't know the Australia house that they're currently at for their isolation, but we do know some of their other impressive properties. If you like these videos, make sure you're subscribed and ring that bell to be notified when we post so you can always be up to date. We've also done house tours in the likes of Leonardo DiCaprio and Ben Affleck, and we'll have links to some at the end of this. Go and follow me on Instagram because I love connecting with you guys. I've also been reading all your comments and I'm going to be responding to some at the end of this. I need you to let me know who to do next in the comments down below and whose home you'd like to see. Now let's get into this video. It would seem that Tom has a thing for the Pacific Palisades area of Los Angeles because most of him and Rita's real estate has been here, including their first home as a couple. A few years back, they put this home on the market, but they owned it for quite some time, through 25 years of their marriage to be exact. Tom and Rita got this home in 1988 when they got married for $1.9 million but put it on the market for over $5 million. The home spans 6,289 square feet of living space and has 4 beds and 5.5 baths. Outside it was a Spanish colonial style mansion and inside it had a pretty neutral and timeless design. There were plenty of high ceilings, exposed beams and open living spaces. The master suite here had a fireplace, large ensuite bathroom and walk-in closet, terrace with ocean views, and even a private beauty salon attached. When it was listed, the home was described as a legendary villa hidden behind private walls and hedges. And of course, there were gorgeous patios, greenery, and gardens outside. But Tom and his wife weren't done with Pacific Palisades, and at one point they even maintained $4 million houses in the area. Pacific Palisades is an elite residential neighborhood in Los Angeles between the Santa Monica Mountains and the Pacific Ocean. You're right by the water here, so there are gorgeous views and scenery. Other celebrities love the area too, even other A-listers like Ben Affleck. Although Tom and Rita owned multiple properties at a time in Pacific Palisades, a few years back they decided to put some on the market. For over a decade, the couple owned three neighboring homes on four connected pieces of land, two of which they decided to sell. Third one we haven't seen much of, but apparently Tom kept it. Their homes are located in the Riviera neighborhood in the Pacific Palisades along the Amalfi Rim, where there's the exclusive Riviera Country Club. Tom and Rita bought the homes in 2003 and 2007 for somewhere around 13 million total. The small the smaller house of the two was a 1930s Spanish revival style villa spanning 3,930 square feet which they bought for about 5.7 million. This house came with 4 beds and 3.5 baths situated on half an acre of land. Surprisingly, neither of the homes came with a pool though. The first home had exposed beam ceilings, wood floors and original fixtures. There was a dining room, high end kitchen, a step down family room with fireplace and wet bar as well as a library and additional living spaces. Outside the backyard offered a flat grass yard, fountain, sunken spa, and views of the canyon and mountains. 
Tom bought the second bigger house for about 7.4 million back in 2007, and this one spans 7,260 square feet of living space with seven beds and 6.5 baths. This home I prefer to the first, and it was built in an English traditional style in 1957. The three-story home had formal living and dining rooms, plus a large pub and billiards room with an exposed wood ceiling. This room, also known as the rec room, had a brick fireplace and full wet bar as well. Another room here is a sunroom lined with French doors, which open up to the backyard and the skylit Eaton kitchen. The bonus room here could be used as a screening room or entertainment room. Their master suite held a lavish bath, an expansive walk-in closet, and three family bedrooms were also on the same upper floor. Two guest bedrooms and a staff suite were located on the lower level, and the third floor held what was called a large playroom. This larger home sat on over half an acre of land with a double-gated motor court and three-car garage. There are a few terraces and outdoor dining areas in the property too. Tom and Rita were successful with their sale of these homes and one buyer bought them together for a combined price of over 17 $5 million. Finally, like I mentioned, Tom and Rita owned a mysterious third house along with these two homes. There are no records of them selling it, and they also like to keep it very private. Apparently, this ranch style home sits on two pieces of land neighboring the two we just saw, totaling 1.08 acres that were bought way back in 1996. This house spans 4,267 square feet, but that's all we really know about it. If you're curious about what Tom owns now, it was reported that him and Rita made what was called a historic historic purchase in the Pacific Palisades back in 2010. The couple bought a massive hillside mansion for over $26 million that at the time broke records being the most expensive home buy in the area. Although Tom kept his mansion private for the most part, we can assume that this is their home base in Los Angeles. This sprawling home spans 14,513 square feet of living space and has four beds and five baths. There are three floors in the house with plenty of balconies that take in the surrounding views. It was built back in 1990 and the previous owners were Kathleen Kennedy, president of Lucasfilm, and husband Frank Marshall. One of the floors is called a support space on the listing, which would include the add-on rooms such as the home movie theater, wine cellar, library, spa, and much more. Outside, there's a tree-lined motor court to park the cars, huge circular yard or terrace, and a cliffside swimming pool. Honestly, this is the first time we're seeing a pool on one of Tom and Rita's properties. Although I wish we could see the interior of this house, I'm sure Tom sold most of his other Pacific Palisades properties because it doesn't look like you'd need much else if you have this massive mansion. Not to mention it's close to both Malibu and Santa Monica. So now we've seen Tom Hanks and his wife Rita Wilson's properties including their previous million dollar houses in Pacific Palisades LA. We also know they own a humongous 26 million dollar mansion in the same neighborhood which I'm sure they're excited to return to after living in Australia. Although they keep a lot of their home details private you can see that the place looks gorgeous. Tom also has more homes away from Los Angeles. The couple owns a residence in the remote mountain town of Ketchum, Idaho, which is a resort community. You may have heard of this place before as it made headlines when Tom took the contractor who built this house to court for poor construction and a few other things. Regardless, Tom's mansion is close to the Sun Valley area and surrounded by luxury amenities such as skiing, nightlife, and more, all with views of Sun Valley's Bald Mountain. His house is believed to be one of the largest in the neighborhood, sitting on 11 acres of land and resembling more of a compound. Pound. There's a swimming pool, tennis court, and three surrounding cottages. Tom and Rita are also rumored to have a place in New York City, as well as two vacation homes in Greece. Rita is of Greek-American background, and as a result, Tom also has a Greek citizenship, and they love the place. Sources say the couple owns a stone villa on a six-acre property on the small island of Antiparos that spans over 4,000 square feet, as well as another seaside villa in a different part of Greece. After seeing some of Tom's multi-million dollar properties, what did you guys think? Okay guys, now read out some comments from previous videos. On our Ellen DeGeneres house tour, Marjorie Port said, I've been watching Ellen forever. I love her. She loves animals, so do I. Great report on Ellen. Keep up the good work. Thanks, Marjorie. I love animals too. On our Post Malone house tour, Joanne Cunningham wrote, I love him. I love all his white cars. He's such a beautiful heart and soul. He's grounded, kind, and don't forget he's so young. He needs to take a huge break away from his life and enjoy himself. I agree, Joan, and I also really bet right about now Post is enjoying his Utah compound with these crazy times. All right, guys, that's all I could find on Tom Hanks and Rita Wilson's properties, including the multi-million dollar homes they've owned over the years in Pacific Palisades and more. 
I totally wish we could see more of the $26 million main home, but it's good for them they were able to keep it so private. Which place did you like best from what we could see? And do you know where Tom is living in Australia? Let me know in the comments as well as what other celebrity houses you'd like to see. Follow me on Instagram if you want to chat and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye!